way. Oh, there we go. Hey, Booski, it's me. Um, I'm gonna pretend like I didn't almost forget to do this again. Uh, that I did. Uh, it's Friday, but you gave me an extension last night. Very kindly. Look, there's Binks. He says hi. Um, because I was in the midst of a little bit of a freak out. Um, I'm still kind of there. <laughs> um, I've officially started applying to grad schools. Um, one application is pretty much done. Uh, one application is like half-ish done. I have one more for sure. Maybe one or two more after that. Um, A, if you count taking the GRE, it's going to cost me around $500 to apply to grad school. So that's awesome. B, um, as I've made my list, I very quickly settled on a list of what schools I wanted to apply to. Um, UCF is one of them, which is where I go now. U of I is one of them, which is where we went. Um, really never thought I'd end up back in Champaign, but um, it's on the list because they have a, um, a program that partners with a really good company. Um, and there's some others, and I don't want to go into too much detail because that's like putting it on the internet and things may change. <laughs> so I don't, but I can I'll text me and I'll text you back about it. But um, it's just been last night I like applied to I filled out most of my UCF applications or my U of I application and I got to a point where I was very much like oh I don't know where I'm gonna be next semester not even next year but next semester like I have no idea geographically where I'll be I have no idea if I'll be a full-time student or if I'll be working or what I'm gonna be doing and that freaked me out a little bit. Um, I'm still processing it because it was very much when I came down here, it was very much in my head like, this is where I'm going, this is where I'm staying, and now it's very much up in the air. It all very much depends on where I get in and what I want to do and what jobs I'm offered, if any. Um, and so, yeah, it's <laughs> the last night I was in the midst of a freak out and I texted you and I was like, can I have an extension? And, you were very kind and gave me an extension and I appreciate that. So today I, I'm feeling a little better, but I'm still very weirded out about it. Um, so Binks is here. It's food time, but I haven't fed him and so he is demanding my attention because if I will not give him food, I must at least give him pets. Um, so that's happening. <laughs> um, other than that, school's going pretty well. Um, I have, I need to really crack down, I think, though, on school stuff. I have no idea what time it is. Um, do, 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 I still can't, okay. Um, I really have to crack down with the school stuff. Um, I have a test coming up this week and test next week, and I don't know when my first linear algebra test is. <laughs> um, so, you know, all good things, <laughs> but, um, there's that, and uh, works going well, and just kind of figuring it all out as I go. Um, what? I don't even know. I don't even know, Marcy. Um, but you know, it, it'll be good, and I, I'm, like, part of me is freaking out, and the other part of me is very excited to just see what happens. Um, so, you know, we'll see. <laughs> um, also... I love your doggy, and is that the doggy that was at my house, or is that a different pit bull with leg surgery? Because I, I felt, I'm just going to leave him on, I feel like that was the doggy that I met, right? Or am I wrong? I could be wrong, but I love your doggy. She's amazing. I want her in my life. Okie dokie. Um, yeah, that's about it. <laughs> that's, oh, so I will let you go. I'll let you go like I'm talking to you right now. Uh, I'm going to end this. Look at the baby. Look at the kitty. Binks, look up here. He refuses. He's like, no mother, I will not do what you do. There he is. He looks so scared. Okay, I'll talk to you later. He's really not as frightened as he looks. Okay, I'll talk to you later. I love you. Bye.